It's not like Michael Jackson anymore. Yeah, the like 70s Michael Jackson. Man, it's too funky to be an ultra man. <laughs> Yo, what's going on you guys? This is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer, here with my lovely wife Johnny Lee on the ones and twos, and this is We Ain't Seen Reactions, the place where we react to everything we've never seen. And today we're definitely reacting to some things we've never seen, which revolves around a special hero within Japanese, I guess you want to call it Tokusatsu. Yeah, definitely a Tokusatsu legend in the game, which is my man, Ultraman. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and put your, your pluses up. Yeah. She over here trying to intersect my stuff over here. Okay. <laughs> Tic-tac-toe. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, We're going to be reacting to all the openings of Ultraman, which is going to be a very long, tall order. So I hope you guys packed your lunch because it's going to be a long day when it comes to this one. I know I say that all the time with stuff like Power Rangers. Which this is, is the last opening we will be doing that is this long yeah this is two hours but it's for a good reason you know what i'm saying uh thanks largely Whoever asked for this you better be glad thanks largely in part to this youtuber by the name of side side Drixar or Drixar. he uploaded all the openings from 1966 to 2022 because a lot of YouTubers claim to do all, all the openings in the compilations but they always fail miserably and they leave out a lot so this guy did his own due diligence and this this is why we're gonna be able to do this yeah but uh yeah man Ultraman I don't really have a lot of familiarity with this other whatever than whatever this is with this costume on look real weird yeah yeah this guy Ultraman like I say he he is one of the OG legends when it comes to Tokusatsu, and um, he's kind of like a byproduct of like stuff like Godzilla, the Kaijus, and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, apparently, the guy who did the special effects for um, Godzilla is the one who created Ultraman. Mm. And actually, look at God. Yeah, it's like apparently we're gonna be watching something that's way before the Ultraman franchise began. You know, because Ultraman actually was introduced in like this big thing like a Twilight Zone show called Ultra Q. It had like different monsters and stuff like that and it, it this was like, like a history lesson I didn't need. Yeah, it's like a what if scenario or so to speak, man. But the only thing that I was able to watch with Ultraman growing up was this show called Ultraman Tiga, which I think came out in the late nineties and then it was brought over and aired in America in I think the early 2000s on something called the Fox Box if you guys are familiar with that so that's the only thing I'm familiar with with that and if you want to include uh, Superhuman Samurai Cyber Squad which that was one of my favorite shows and it's kind of like the cousin of Ultraman on his mama side you know that you can include that too because that's done by Super Ride Productions which also does Ultraman so yeah guys um you know my wife she ain't all for all the talk talk she ready to just go I mean, ahead and just jump into it a whole history lesson and a whole you know i mean you know how i like to do man i know somebody out there appreciate it all uh two of you guys but uh let's go ahead and do this man like all two of you that's about all for real man but yeah this is gonna be all the opening so let's do it ultra q 1966 That shit looks scary. Look like one of those things the therapist hold up and be like, what do you think? Yeah. Um, an ass. Okay, okay. What about this one? An elbow. That's a little scary looking eyeball. Right. right Whose eyeball is that? Debo? It's Godzilla's first cousin. This sounds like some spooky music. Hey, man. Like some of these things have dark origins to them. It's like you got a giant fruit roll up man that comes from something like this. From what I heard or from what I've read, this monster is like an amalgamation of different like leftover stuff from a Godzilla movie. So if he looks like a Godzilla knockoff, it's basically what he is, I think. Okay, they got the Kappa Bebop uh, sounds up in this shit. Why does it look like a cross between Big Bird feet and I don't even know what else. <laughs> said. Just let it go. Forget what I said, y'all. 
Somebody need to clip their toenails. I think that's a horn. Oh, well, somebody need to clip their horns then. Yeah. I like how my man was just walking through the hood, man. He just taking his precious time. Yeah, you can definitely tell that's a Godzilla. Like, originally. Well, he looked way more scary than Godzilla. Those eyes are what the original Godzilla's eyes look like. Yeah, whoever... Whoever made these openings loved their little psychedelic. This is the 60s. It's got to be psychedelic. Yeah. George Clinton was over there helping them with this. Probably did. Probably had the Funkadelics over there. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, somebody was choking when they was playing the instrument for a second. Yeah. Is that the monster again? I think that is. Okay, like he about to eat on something. Keeping it a short to see. It's like, I'm finna eat this building like it's Chinese takeout. All the kids singing with me now. Hey. This shit is groovy. This is something my grandma would have been doing a twist to in the club. Mm. Is that Donkey Kong? Look like it. <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck that is. His shoulder game is on point. Okay, he has good form. <laughs> That's a weird looking monster. He look like he need to be on monsters. Ain't hey, I was gonna say all real monsters. You have an obsession with all real monsters. I mean, it's the OG. It came before whatever, Monsters Inc. Whatever. Monsters Inc. Jack. That's it. why you we finna look at this Ultra Seven opening right Ultra now. Ultra Seven, Ultra Seven Eleven. They got their own convenience store. Holy pixels, baby! Man, I can't even make oh, out what right. that is. I think the stuff is gonna shake. And yeah, form maybe. Words. That was kind of cool. That was. I thought it was bad picture quality at first. It is cold in here. Mm -mm. Why does this song remind me of History by Michael Jackson? It reminds me of that song that plays anytime Takamura is about to win. He's like, I can't lose now. The peanut gallery is waiting on me. Mm. You remember when he was going to fight that bear? Mm. I look like I'm watching Big O. I wonder if Big O is inspired after this. Seven. Okay, so now I know the origin of this song that I've been hearing in a lot of anime and stuff. It's so funny. Earlier, you was like, all the children sing. And it's like, no, these do sound like children. Yeah. Seven. Seven. This is like a dick measuring contest of whose spaceship is bigger. Mine. <laughs> uh, you got a big forehead or you got some damn um, goggles on or something. Yeah, from what I heard, like kids went crazy over Ultraman. It's like they're already like crazy over Not giant monsters. We done skipped. We done went from six They had to, to take to a break. You see how they had to revamp it, put some good shit up in there. They had to put some New Year's Eve sparkles on it. They did, man. It's almost like these openings be trying to hypnotize people into watching their show. Let me find out. That's what Super Raya was on. So we need to hypnotize them. We need to get them to watch the show and buy the merchandise. Just keep on twirling. Another song we can twist to. Get it. Still got the silhouettes. I'm actually enjoying the silhouettes. It's not a sensory overload when you're looking at yeah, openings. There'll just be so much going on. You ain't getting bombarded with a lot of crazy shit that you're right. already confused Explosions on. Explosions and whatnot everywhere. I can appreciate this. Who saw they got on this? She was trying to get a lot of kids on this shit. They're like a school teacher. Oh. Yeah, he finna teach them something, all right? <laughs> shit. You better come up, come up here with that homework. That's all I know. Right, we're going to pull up on your ass. Mm -hmm. 
Charles at us demons. Your ass kicked ho. Get your ass kicked ho. Stop the violence. No. (laughs) 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 He's like, I say the name, bitch. Yeah, right? Honestly. (laughs) He's like, can we just be in peace? Stop the violence. I don't think so. (laughs) Ultraman Ace. I like how this this person took the time to give you a description of the show. The title name and everything in the year. Okay, we got Scrooge I'm coming to at the us. 80s because you know. That's what it looks like. It looks like Because you know the 80s is always wild for openings of oh, yeah. kind of shows. I'm pretty sure like stuff like Super Sentai made them step their game up. Mm-mm, it's jamming right here. See, it be jamming until they start singing. <laughs> I'm ready to get down so they start I like, singing. I like the inclusion of the I kids and stuff. like the sound of children. It's like when a character makes a great impression and the opening is just a hit. Mr. Krabs, back in the day. For real, Lobsterkules' uncle. Um, I don't know who that is. I don't even know either. I'm gonna hit the thriller dance on your ass. That's what it looked like you finna do. For real. I'm finna get down while I'm destroying the city. Rhinox. I actually really love this opening style because it somewhat prevents spoilers. Right. It's like you wish, like you're kind of hoping that you see those silhouettes. You're like, you're curious. You can't wait to see those characters, but you don't know in what context it's gonna be. I Mm -hmm. appreciate those types of openings. Ultraman Taro. I just wonder how much longer. Oh, the Mizumi Children's Chorus. I ain't even noticed. That's what it said, y'all. Look at me. Whoop. All right, here y'all go. Y'all pressing buttons now. What does right? this button do? I don't see no silhouettes no more. Okay, we got the uh, Michael Bay, Bay Lynch flares. J.J. Abrams made this. Play it. Yeah, I think they're done with the silhouettes. Uh-oh. That's Number pretty good. six. Yeah. But this could be 19, what was that, 73 it said? That looks good. Yeah, I think this guy said that he got somebody to remaster some of these for him. But even if it was bad quality, it's not, that's not even what I'm saying. I'm just oh, saying yeah. It, it looks good it for looks, its turn. Yeah. yeah. I would have suspected this was from like the 80s or early 90s or something if I didn't know any better. Oh, yeah. That's what I can appreciate about Japanese live action shows and stuff. It's like the quality always gradually improves. And some of it was ahead of its uh, time. This looks really good to me. Alright, man, we gotta go our separate ways now. Right? <laughs> Don't forget about me. What well, aim? Show no heroes. They just showed the stuff for I can her. appreciate that though. Ultraman Leo. Once again, the Mizumi Children's Chorus, everyone. Mizumi kids, man, they got about 20 kids by now. Probably. Explosions. <laughs> Okay. I don't like that costume. Yeah, it look cool. He look like he got a uh, Laffy Taffy all over his body with a few metal pieces. Go ahead, children, sing it. That shit kind of came in like Earth, Wind, and Fire a little bit. Uh, that's all I think he was missing. Sang children. Fukiyanae. Go ahead. This is cool. It's kind of giving me robot chicken vibes, though. You can tell some of this is mostly stop motion. Unless the frame rate is just that slow. Go 
Oh, y'all yeah. busting it. Y'all blowing up buildings? Boy, they say they blowing it up. Y'all they supposed to be the good the guys, game. man. Collateral damage. This must have been the original San Andreas movie before The Rock adapted it. I'd rather watch this. <laughs> right? At least you'll know which movie it is. You won't get all the movies confused. It was actually the outline of some real people right there. Right, that was like a gem a little bit. It was. Yuki Fight Hide. Ultraman, once again, everybody, the Mizumi Children's Chorus. Right. Just some of these kids ought to be adults now. They should. Like I say, they just keep on having kids. It's their grandkids right here. Okay, this must be like a sequel series to that. It came out the same year. Yeah. Who the Oh! Ooh. 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 Who the fuck your ass? He's singing it now. He is. This sounds like some song they force you to learn in kindergarten. Right. Or in elementary school that you later learn out learned that it was like a racist song back in the day. Right. This shit probably a national anthem in Japan. That's so, what you this, know. This just remind me of like some Honda. songs I had to learn when I was a kid. I know it's not, but Yeah. I'm seeing the same footage, but it's just a different song. I kinda like the last song more than this one. This stuff still looks really good. They had to know. give a positive kind of song to match the destruction. So if we're gonna just blow up cities, we gotta give a more energetic song to go along with it. What is the ah? So from from what I take of this, Ultraman uses giant robots too. Yeah. Cause I, I was I was assuming that we'll see more Ultraman himself in giant form. Oh, okay. Coming at you. <laughs> right? Dude, does, does this remind you of something other we saw in Gintama? That girl. Yeah. Of course, yeah. Yeah, it's like I think that's what they were parodying, mm -hmm. like basically this. I like this. Yeah, it looks smooth. Oh, it's Spin around in for a twist real. Wheel. Okay, he got his own background dancers. Oh, he's a chubby one. Yeah, there always has to be a chubby one. Put your hands up. We can come in peace. So, um, was this the first cartoon I'm assuming? I guess so. What did he shoot out a net code? Oh, uh, a dimension to another series. <laughs> He's just having the time of his life Boy, up in this the sky. Nasty. For real. Ooh, I like how you did that. It's like step back. Catch the logo. Nineteen eighty. Let's see if they still got the Mizumi children court. Them children can't. They ain't on there. No they ain't more. featured up in the description no more. I don't even know. Shiny. Okay, this is the beginning of the Stone Cold Steve Austin thing. Just imagine Stone Cold coming out to this. Japanese Elton John? Right. I'm an Ultraman. Ultra Kick. I feel you. <laughs> Get your <laughs> So you have to they didn't even let him complete his flip. They didn't. I don't know if he's doing a flip or the worm. I like it though. It's like you have to play the guessing game. Right. Which pose is he going to end in? This does sound like somebody trying to be a Japanese Elton John. It do. It has a little soul to it, too. A little piece. This is what happens when you put grown men up in the booth to sing. No more Mizumi children, of course. Like a rock. Oh, like an Ultraman. The Columbia All-Stars. Okay, let's uh -oh. see what y'all sounding like. 
Don't tell me it's the same opening with some different singers. Hey, we had to come in, man. We got to bring in David Ruffins. Oh, they brought the kids back. Okay, is that his human form? He look a little bit decent. I like That's walking probably somebody's grandpappy now. On the beach, taking long walks in the forest. Right. And randomly running to the bathroom. Looking through the flowers at my crush. Yeah. Cameraman, catch me. Get the foliage out of the way. That is, you can tell that's inspired after like Star Wars, yeah. like the undershot of the ship. Mm-hmm. Like the big Starcraft. It's always floods up in this show, though. I mean, it is Japan. I know. It's like, I guess that makes sense. You got giant monsters causing these earthquakes. Yeah. I think Godzilla represents like nature, like the water destroying stuff. And it's they're like destroying that, it. That monster farted. And cause all this. Right? The wind. He really literally broke wind. For real. Oh shit. What happened to the chubby one? Right? Put your hands up. <laughs> they say in live action we can't handle chubby one. Right. The silver giant. Shinsuke Kazato. Shinsuke Nakamura. Uh oh. It's like it was recorded on CD ROM. South Australian. I'm actually pretty much enjoying these older ones. Yeah. I'm just hoping I still enjoy it when it gets to the newer ones. Cause oh my goodness. That looked that look like... What is this? A uh, reboot, y'all? What are we watching? <laughs> Tattoo Teenage Alien Hunters. <laughs> ah! Like these are all Ultraman sworn enemies. It that looks are, a little weird, but I actually can appreciate this though. Uh, it looks like it's in sixty frames per second too. Yeah, it's definitely sixty frames. It's almost like um, a oil oil pastel painting. How it looks. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that's different. It has a funkiness to it, but. Yeah. Okay, yeah, the suit looks more streamlined. This is what I'm more accustomed to seeing mm-hmm. when I think of Ultraman. Let me out of here! I'm on parole, nigga! <laughs> I actually really like this one. This reminds me so much of the Nutcracker, this music. My boy said for, I love the Nutcracker. for T'Challa. <laughs> With that one. Mm. Okay, we in the 90s now. Oh, we got the... Oop, I didn't even get the name right. We got the children for us back. Uh-oh. This looks like the same one. Except a lot faster. It's like they just got to bring the kids in, at least on the second part, don't they? Yeah, it's a different one. And the quality on this one is a little not that great. Yeah. Now, I like the one without the singing, though, because no. Mm-mm. I was more immersed in it with the... No singing. I mean, this guy, he got nice lyrics. I mean, we don't know what the hell he's saying. I mean, like, nice vocals. I can feel his vocals. The kid's vocals is not nice. No. I don't know who wants to purposely hear the sound of children singing. Right. But yeah. Whoever did this, y'all could have just used the same visuals and just overlaid it over these vocals since it's basically the same opening. No, they got to stay true to the game. You did just fine. It's kind of disjointed this way. I mean, that's just a representation of what happens when you put kids on the track. Uh, a train wreck. Let me leave kids alone. Yeah, leave the kids out of this. I, was like, I, did, not like, I did not like hearing children. This way you're going to do is little pelvic thrust. Wait, wait for it. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> <"Bitch."> What kind of forever? What kind of forever? Ultimate oh, Hero. Oh, shoot. 1993. Yeah. Let's see what y'all talking about. Super Ride Productions presents an ass kicking adventure well, with psychedelic and all kinds of Microsoft PowerPoint effects. Right? Have you ever seen the ultimate editing team? Well, this isn't it. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is 
Like, what is this? I can like, appreciate PowerPoint this. or like um, scroll animation? I, it's simple. I can appreciate. I love simple openings. Yeah. Ooh, that's like a sad monster. Oh, somebody with a Let me know if you need me to pause it. Is there the package? Ooh, Aaron Griffin. Huh? Well, we'll react to this one here and yeah. I feel like I'm watching like one of those old school 90s sitcoms with those openings. Oh, mm -hmm. shit, we got a Titan. Right. <laughs> it just don't have a name of the character. Right. I think his name is Sheldon. Starro from um, Suicide Squad 2. Beastacia. So it has a very positive sound while it's showcasing these demonic Be entities. Right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, meet the demonic family who's coming to terrorize your town. Uh, Sha -na -na -na. Who's going to pause it? Super Rider Production presents. Yeah, this feel like more nineties. Looks a little dark too, though. It like got like some darker elements to it. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, Cynthia. They got a white woman up on this. Right, I was thinking that. I'm like, where the Asian woman at? Right. But well, okay, you gotta have Sonya Blade up in there. <laughs> For real. They got um fucking Star Command or Special Forces. He said, "I'm going about the ground." That's how you do it, man. These monsters actually look pretty good. They do. That's what they specialize in. <laughs> hey. There you go, boy. Uh oh. Okay, so Maybe they just. The whole crew is white. For real. They got Tyrone up in the command center. Oh, shit. I forgot about Tyrone. <laughs> boy. This must be supposed to be like in America or something. That's the thing. I'm assuming all those were Americans. Or maybe this is just a bunch of Americans working overseas or something. I don't know. I don't know. We might need to watch this to figure out the backstory. Yeah. He looked like Pepsi Man right here. Pepsi Man. Take me higher. Okay, so they got There a, must have been so This is the one that came in, in the States. Uh-oh. Uh, good. Holy 60 frames per second, Batman. Yeah, this is the one I remember. It came over in the States in the early 2000s. I am about to say, there must be a lot, a lot, a lot of Ultraman that went on from 1990-something to oh, now. Yeah. Because... They have different era names for this shit. They call from them... From 1960-something to 1990-something, it ain't been that many open. Yes. Mm-mm. Driving on the freeway? I know, right? Why like they driving on um, juicy fruit trucks and shit? Mm -hmm. This looks very clear. Mm -hmm. Gonna Tiga. I don't know what right? What does that stand for, man? Praise the Lord, I'm back. Is that his human form? So I'd be so confused. I don't know who's Ultraman. I don't know if he's his own thing or if a human turns into him. I have no idea how that works. Dinah. Mm. Okay. Chris. <laughs> Dina. I'm that nigga. Or I'm that diner. <laughs> okay, so they're kind of taking it back, you know what I'm right, saying? Yeah. You're like oh my eyes to the classics. Get a good look at it. Good look at it. Sailor with it. Oh, 
Stop! Guts. Is Tyrone still part of the squad? No, they figured it out this time. Oh. Okay, Tyrone was probably the maintenance man. He knew how to fix the cars. Yeah, they got stuff. rid of Tyrone, Sally, and Rebecca. They did. It's definitely getting better. You, know, I, you see, like more detail. Mm -hmm. It's like the color motifs remain the same, but <clears throat> you got the jewel in the eye. The face looks more angular. Oh. Y'all be ready to shoot, man. I got my hands up. Shit, Ultra Man Gaia. So he gonna be Earth based. He gonna be fighting trees and shit. Well, yeah, two of them. They, they brothers on here? <laughs> Better do it. Gaia power. <laughs> that look like somebody uncle. He do. Like somebody uh, nieces. That look like Hi, somebody I'm, uncle. I'm an uncle too. Right. This is where we take out our trash. It's like a ship shitting out mini ships. Special effects look decent for the time. They this. look really good. The way they did that unison turn. <laughs> right. The uncle turn. Oh, there goes There you go. Shelton Benjamin. Shoot. <laughs> Don't forget about me. Yeah, it just caused more tsunamis, guys. Yeah. Bet they ankle strived after that one. Thousand Ultraman Neos. Right. That is far, far away. For real. Beyond those stars, a hero is born. There's a black hole. Oh yeah, a lot of collateral damage from a black hole. But I am here. Right. It's like even though the years progress with these, they still retain some kind of like Less retro type of deal, vibe yeah. to them. Yeah. It's like they are staying true to the traditions. Oh shit, they got trapped. We are in danger. We are in danger. We gotta help them, y'all. I'm a little drunk right now, though, so Ooh. bear with me. <laughs> you can do this. Got you, bro. Use it to push your way back. The hell is that? A, a lamp? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Hell no. He over there flying in the outer space. Somebody help him. He right. It's like, is his insurance going to help him out with that? Nope. They ain't going to cover that. Like, that's kind of a ominous ending right there. I mean, he just for... went off. This man gets knocked back. I, maybe that's how he becomes Ultraman. I don't know. Maybe we'll figure out what happened to him in this opening. Ultraman Cosmos. Maybe this is a continuation. Maybe, because he got stuck in the car. Oh, hell no. Yeah, that look a little janky. Hell no. Oh, this is an opening cutscene. Yeah. All right. This sounds very 2001. It do. It's like the Ultraman PS1 game or something. Have you ever seen such a beautiful man? <laughs> it looks like it. I, I guess their little ring helps them transform. I don't know what happened. That looks... I don't know what it looks like, but it looks... Oh, oh. <laughs> I don't have Who that much articulation. 
His mom. Probably, because that's what it looked like. Why did the hair in the 1990-something ones look normal, but the hair in this one look weird? I knew it was going to do it. Yeah, you knew it. It's going to have some kind of 90s boy hair. But it's 2001. I know. Want to be right? I sure do. Okay, he looks good in some of these scenes. Yeah, when he first showed up, he looked a little crazy. He just can't move that much. Yeah. You know, they It'll didn't, get better, I'm They sure. didn't get my boy Regan right, so he, like, he had arthritis in his Ooh. shoulder. I'm trying to figure out. We already in 2004. How do we have over an hour left? I don't even know. Probably like other spinoffs or some shit. Nickelback. Okay, Deep Blue Sea. Ooh, I like that. He like he mixed in with the Gaba or something. Look cool right there. For real, got the LEDs up in the ass. Yeah, yeah. That right here. Now, what I will say, I like how these people's physiques are. Whoever they get to play in those suits, they they look the part. They got mm-hmm. a heroic build. Transformation. I am not here to play with you. <laughs> You had to break it down a little bit. This might be my favorite one so far. Yeah, it's hidden. Can I move it closer? Mm. The wish. Oh, the right is cleared out. Hey, hey. <laughs> he got the new. He got the universal remote that controls right. everything. Okay, they control the Roku. <laughs> For real, it's like it don't never get lost because it lights up the whole right. room. Yes, Ultra Beam, baby. All right, this one right here is hype. Yeah, I love this. This one. shit is this, hype that's as hell. One so far. <laughs> All right, Ultra Nexus Blue Fruit. So Blue Face got a cousin named Blue Fruit who's from Japan, y'all. This shit look pretty. Mm, it did look like some <laughs> For real. Oh, he over here doing sit ups and flip ups and dips. Why you better play it? Mm. That's how I can damn WCW entrance music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. He got knocked the fuck out. Oh, he knocked himself out. Yeah. Okay, he's an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bro, you don't want to be an idiot when people are walking underneath your feet. It's different when you're a normal sized person. Okay. Oh, she on the floor a little with the For nail real. polish. I like how the transitions are in the character yeah. introductions, but man. It's like still staying true to the Ultraman formula of those silhouettes and yeah. sliding and stuff like that. Oh, you almost. Okay. I mean, the Ultraman is all I got now. Okay, he's the mastermind behind all this idiocy. No, I'm quit. It sounds like a church song, too, hell. Oh, it <laughs> Yeah, I see y'all down there. Right. Those was those two two thousand four ones. It was great. They was Ultraman Max. I think another reason why there's probably so much, but we're in the nineties right now, is because they got like these different ones that were done by different studios, and they all had their own respective eras. That's it, two thousand four. I know. That's what I'm saying. It might be other studios that take over too that got their own versions. I don't know. I don't either. Oh no, we aren't even halfway through. What they got the police vehicle? They do. What was that red alert from Transformers? They like they cut that out with some scissors. <laughs> I think I've seen these monsters before in the when past. They give the first graders the job to cut out the stars for the uh, school decorations. Right. For the school play. 
Wait, it's got holes for boobs. <laughs> That's just nipples. I like them suits though. Yeah, those do look cool. I wear that to church. They should have sold that off more. It's like they, they sponsored by Omni Man. Ooh. No. There's something about the texture on this suit. See, it almost makes him look cool mm -hmm. and CG, but still practical. 2006. Ultraman. My was born. Mm. Okay. Unlimited. Mm. It's like we was watching a different show and then they was like, hold on, y'all. Let me tell you what you can win right quick. Is he supposed to be inspired after a Trojan or something? Because he got a little fan going at the top. Okay, hey, Andy. That doesn't look like that's what his name is. Right. Todd. Gina. Julia. Oh, Damn. close. Close enough. Scott. Right. <laughs> Scott the Chop. For real. April. Drea. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you know somebody's going to be down in the comments. Actually, her name is... I know. You know people think we, that we've been We're serious. We're not serious. It's like we don't even know what that the, like the subtitles. They do. They got their own command center. But I've got to know what was going on with Japanese people in like the 2000s with their hair. Because it was... Yeah. It was intriguing, to say the least. I know, man. Like, I would love to know if they could do my hair like that. But they'd hmm. probably be like, what am I supposed to do with this? Why is his chest blinking? He need to charge up his battery or something. Uh-oh, Maleficent. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we, we just saw our first morph. Well, I'm over here trying to sing to these people. I oh, you didn't get a chance to see him. I seen them the morph, but I mean, I was trying to sing to them. Oh, okay. They yeah. pay for us to sing to Man, them. I, I mean, they're not paying on YouTube. They pay for this. To oh, okay. Sing to they probably paying for it when they after clicking on this video. Ooh. Crunch and munch for lunch. What we got for brunch? Mount Crushmore. For real. I feel you. I want to show off that CGI. Y'all put the money into it. Probably got sponsors paying. Oh. Oh, no, shoot. <laughs> no, this looks like Power Rangers. Yeah. Hey. See, them monsters are probably just having a good time. That's their way of um, entertaining themselves. And here y'all go. Inserting yourselves and putting their party in. Yeah, <laughs> right. I'm just playing snake. So you snuck into my garage. Right. Well, since you're here, get the fuck out of there. Definitely, Uncle. I'm not watching porn. Right. <laughs> Handling serious business over here. Oh, <laughs> he hit that broken. He off. did. It was that Seamus that got him right? in the suit. Don't think because I don't have a lot of articulation in these wings, I'm gonna slap your ass. We was buddies, but you drunk all the beer. Mm -hmm. Zap Spacey. Uh oh. I like a potato chip logo. Oh my god. Yeah. It's like modernized version of those monsters we saw from earlier. Ultra Galaxy Mega Monster Battles. Something. Ooh. What are these Never logos? Ending Odyssey. Right, these our logos get better and flashier. <laughs> that Lucy Pearl? No. <laughs> I want to destroy it tonight. I'm going to flip tonight. Yeah, bro. Get kicked in the nuts. It sounds like some Luffy music. Yeah. It's almost like the humans are secondary while the monsters are the main stars or something. For this one. I want to see if Uncle is going to be in this one still. You know he is. He's going to be over there watching um, X Hamster. <laughs> 
The Ripper, I could shoot. <laughs> there, Uncle Go. Okay, I was just about to blast my computer to get rid of all my history. Right. <laughs> Slap, slap. <laughs> I told God. you to wash them dishes. Wait, he dives on the floor. He missed the whole person. Right, that's right how there. it is, man, when you're having a monster wrestling match. It's a missed spot. <laughs> elbow drop. That, that, that is hilarious. Oh! <laughs> I, I, I would it. watch this. It just needs a commentator. The Special Monster Olympics. They probably make all the money from the proceeds and shit. <laughs> that was too funny. Ultraman Ginga, 2013. Legend of Galaxy. Ooh. No poison all the Ultraman. They all look crazy. It looked like they needed to be poisoned. Yeah. It's like all a bunch of your friends and your mom walks in. What y'all doing up in here? Right. Oh, shoot. Ooh. He didn't come to play with that monster. He did. Why well, he got the Simon Says machine on his chest. You got to press it when the color tells him to. Why well, you got the duck lips, man? You, you got, got the <laughs> chili bowl. What is your big ass doing on the slide? Y'all are too big to be on the slide. For real. I ain't gonna lie, Simon. You look a little creepy. Everybody look creepy on here in their own way. He do. He like he could play um. What's that dude named Sogo from uh, uh Gintama? There you go. I need to see more of that, man. <coughs> Somebody got armor. Ooh, man, I have a hard time fighting that one. Like, he was made out of complete stone. <laughs> he was like he in business when he did that pose. Right, I like how he did that. Say, like, hey y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and make y'all appear hmm. for a pose. Be happy I did so that. Yeah, Ginga. Like they're gonna recycle the same opening, but use. I'm getting tired of seeing these heroes get poisoned like this. Kiss already. <laughs> right. Play it. Goddamn Carlos Santana playing that shit. Mm. I feel you, man. Do that. Eat some more. Eat some Eat some more. Y'all done brought the parents into this shit. Why would you do that? Right. There you go. Explode into the stars with it. <laughs> I kind of feel like these monsters have a big disadvantage because they can't move as fast as this nigga. He can pretty much do all the stuff at that size. Like all these other monsters have T Rex arms right. and they have wings and they have to resort right. to just slapping each other. Like of course you're gonna win. Right. Well, like you get to have a dance off and everything while you whoop these monsters' asses. Okay, you can put up a better fight. Right. You know, poses are my favorite. Yeah. And I'm not like, I'm becoming a more of an Ultraman fan than I am a Super Sentai fan. Mm. Cause it's just straightforward with it. It ain't nothing confusing yet. I'm all for the confusing shit, but this right here just it's it's surface level, man. Ooh. Eh? Thought he was gonna go over there and hit that Bobby Brown on the one time. I like his suit. Right? Uh oh. Oh, okay. Kinda cool. Everybody drip is on point too, man. Yeah. It's like we got the money, we got the sponsors, we got drinks. We get to play around while the boss is trying to work. No. Uh oh, girl. Not a fairy woman. All right, she like a damn J pop A queen lady. The prime minister. Right. <laughs> the fresh new vehicle. Say, say Nissan. Yep. 
<laughs> I guess they sponsored this or something. It was something like you said, you may be avalanche. Yeah. You may be avalanche and out of here. We'll destroy everything around you. Why do you remind me of Draken? He do kind of look like Draken. Draken again. Right. These energetic sperms will destroy you. I gotta stop singing. Somebody needs to stop me. Are those all the Ultraman from the past? Or are those just like newer versions that look similar? I don't know. They look like the classics. Ultraman X. 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 Marble fighting. I know, right? Uh, damn, Tatsunoku versus Capcom. It's always got to be something X. Yeah. In everything we watch. It's. Well, he said he gonna play with his action figures right in the opening. This might be the tenth Ultraman series. I don't know. I know they finna go crazy on all these different transitions and shit, though. Saying that. It's like we're looking up from a Transformers heads up display. It's a crazy looking monster. Yeah. Ten. 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 They're going to transform into a robot, huh? By ten. I know they probably ain't y'all thing, but shit. Ooh. He got Yu-Gi-Oh cards with his shit. Okay, he got power-ups too? There we go. Whooping up on two Godzillas. Right. He be overpowered. Legendary oh, pictures. Legendary, they need to do a, a Ultraman Americanized version like they did with Godzilla and King Kong. Mm-hmm. Like bring Ultraman to the mix somehow. They might call him something else. Like they might call him Ultra Dude or something. Mm-hmm. Or Ultimate Man. Ultimate Man. <laughs> you know how America's like to fuck shit up. Well, it ain't broken, don't need to be fixed. Okay, they got a Shikon jewel up in there. Orb, okay. Miss Handcuffs? SPD. Oh, y'all got different kind of letters to go with y'all stuff. SSP. Ah! I'm not a school shooter, I promise. Ah! We got a pop gun. SSP. You down with SSP? Yeah, Secret you show me. Ah. Oh. oh, they can summon Ultramans? That's cool. That is cool. Oh, wow. I didn't give him enough time to shine. Y'all fused him too quick. Look at <laughs> There's something about the. I don't know. I just love the way this thing looks when it's in its frame rate. Oh, uh oh! It looks like they're dancing with each other. Like I wouldn't be surprised if the next scene they just saw them, like just dancing. I like it. Yeah, you see how my man hit that usher speaking with it. Mm. <laughs> oh man! I know why it's this long. Why? Never mind. No, I don't. Oh, I thought you had something for a second. I'm like maybe one half is live action and one half is cartoon. Maybe. Yeah, I didn't think about that. But we just saw a cartoon in the middle. Okay, we get it. You like Robin, man. We get it. Uh oh. Georgina, you better hit that. You better do it. Little flappy sword. Oh, shit. She found out her credit score is minus 10. <laughs> <laughs> he has a family and he just tripped on a banana that's on the concrete, which doesn't make any sense. Ooh. Like a live action version of Tinya Ida. So they got five hour energy drinks that they use to transform in this one. Yeah. Yes, Bro, you need to get an iron for your suit. You're a little too wrinkled up. Ooh, I like that one though. What are you thinking about the design so far? 
I've just been immersed in the whole thing. The designs have been really cool for the most part. Yeah, I, I just like how they show off his heroic physique, man. I love her hair. Yeah. Close it. Who the hell that is at the top? Shit, that's they got. The, right, I say, who got the God Ultra Man right there? Right. My man, Jehovah, man. <laughs> that's all that I can come up with. Mega Man coins or Ultra Man coins. Ultra Man, dude. Dance off, bro. Let's go to the store, get our drip on point. This is my idiot brother, Tojo. My thirsty sister, Amanda. This is our dad, Marco. <laughs> He's an idiot. Right? This is our uncle. Uncle Jimmy? Why is like he said, I gotta do that? Do that? Right. Alright, that's what I'm talking about. Now that is straight up double dragon shit. It's like Ultra Man like just. Fire one's helmet. Yeah. They just be showing out when they be in Ultraman form. It's like we can just turn giant and do all kind of flips for no reason. Right. Alright. Y'all invited to the cookout, but you gotta Ooh. shrink now. Yeah, brothers forever. Mm -hmm. Happy and we singing and we colored. Buddy steady go. Okay. Uh, I feel you. <laughs> I like how he dropped down when the music dropped. CGI teams seems to be getting a little better. I think it's been a little pretty good for a while. Yeah, I'm talking about with Ultraman himself, though. Mm -hmm. You know, usually they show him he can't move that much. Mm -hmm. Ooh. He look like he ain't playing no games. He like he crazy. He do. Okay, he's evil. No wonder. Even his ultra man look crazy. Yeah. Man, y'all collaborated with Nintendo to make this beat. My bad. Hmm. Nah, that's cool. <laughs> You gonna kick your way down? This nigga to destroy stuff. That dude look extra thick over there. Yeah, he do. <laughs> it's like all these tricky lessons I've been taking are really gonna pay off. Ooh. We're insurance agents. All right. Ooh. Bro, you should be trying to prevent that in the background. Not pose in front of it. Sue no, uh, I asked you to chant my name. Chant it. Because you ain't saying it loud enough. Well, he started off loud. He did. He had to. This is before the, uh, the big outbreak happened. He finally started coughing because of C-19. <laughs> <laughs> you like he was startled to be interviewed or something. Right. Granddad. Hello. Right. Oh no. Why <laughs> like a damn lobster claw? Hurry up. I like how this super dimensional thing is like squeezing out Ultraman like a turd. It's like he has to go little by little like... Mm. That's what I have to look at it as. My actual space ass. Ooh, okay. This one's fast. 
I said the mini Godzilla, Mecha Godzilla over there. Right. That's kind of weird. Trigger. So it's gonna be a lot of uh, okay, Ultraman, mm-hmm. Tiga. Oh, by the time they had a female Ultraman or woman. Ooh, this one looks very stylistic already. It does. Yeah, put it over my nuts. You tell she's a scientist of the group, and he's the meathead. He's the true school for school guy, the straight guy. All right, and this is the alien. Yeah, this is the one who's eating up our budget. And this is my granddad. <laughs> ah, they had a whole curse mark. Oh, they got USB drives up in their morphos. That's cool. Squeeze them out. Yep, there you go. Yeah, I would love to see more people dress up at, as Ultraman at conventions. Well, now it's your time to shine. Might be. I don't know if they make Ultraman costumes in your size, though. That's why they have custom-made suits. Yeah, I guess. It's probably expensive. Do it, Tiga. Pull the trigger. <laughs> she like the god or <laughs> evil empress. Yeah, Ultraman Decker. Double deck that thing up. I don't know why time is transitioning better smoothly. It's like it doesn't feel like we've been in here for an hour. Wake up! Well, you better pay attention to this opening. Don't be falling asleep on us. I'm going Arthur mode on y'all. For real. Yeah, they drip just gets better and better. It's like, that's no wonder this mm-hmm. thing has been around for so long. Woo! I got shit! Somebody take over! Yeah, they love their um, aircrafts and stuff. Ooh! <laughs> yeah, that's something that never changes. Like whenever they summon this nigga, or he comes out of nowhere. Ooh, I like that. Oh, get him! Get him! There you go. Get pieced up, boy. I'm swagging on you too. <laughs> that is so cool. So you can. <laughs> Ooh, he has telepathy too. Psycho powers. Yeah. Turn around with it. Act like you know who he is. I got your back. Andro Melos. And we went back in time again? Right. And I was thinking it might be split in the cartoon, but it's not. But it's on camera. It is. Hey. Mellow Sue. Yeah. Uh, it's a long ass pose, man. Can't be posing too much. You might have to put some WD 40 on your joints. Ooh, okay. Shit, shit went from being positive to just downright destructive and disrespectful. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that nigga did that armor king on him. <laughs> oh. They armor look like Power Rangers or up more armorized. Ultraman Zafi Toffee. Are these movies? I think so. Maybe that's why it's like this. So they went from showing the series and now they're showing a live action. Ooh. Shit like a Pepsi commercial. Mm. 
play it. Y'all ready to Jackson over there. <laughs> Feel like I'm in an action packed smoothie right now. Wow! Different flavors of ass whoopings for you. Get a shot of my ass. Oh. Yeah, yeah, a shot of the crotch. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Burn. Yeah. It's like just stop it in the most awkward position it you possibly is. can think of. Like the most compromising positions and shit. It's like save this guy, man. He might get attacked by a kaiju when I have him frozen in position like this. Like he's gonna <laughs> chop somebody. This is no different from what that chick was doing at the beginning of the in living like the living single yeah, opening. Right. Maybe she got inspired by Ultra Man. Why his eyes look like droopy? That some shit. You gotta edit that out again. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Main title, story mode. Ooh. Ooh. Right. Ooh. All I think it was Michael Jackson's silhouette up in the background. <laughs> Pretty baby with the armor on. They give me fights like I never ever known. I flip from galaxy to solar systems. And I don't know what else to say. Ah, uh, that went good. It, it was, but it wasn't. Oh. It's not like a Star Fox theme song. It's like they don't even want to stop, man. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Ultraman is nice. He is the nice guy, man. Ooh. <laughs> it's like fuck turbo man this is what a real action figure looks like boy this <laughs> 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 is like you got my face I don't care who you is I get jumped Get the one in the middle. Right. Oh, <laughs> man, this old man getting messed up. over, bro. <laughs> ah. <laughs> A little judo chop, Dr. Evil style. Get your hands off right? me. Boy, did I tell you about disrespecting your elders? You got the nerve to punch my nipples? I'm trying to figure out if this is a comedy Ultraman or is this serious? This cannot be serious. <laughs> he keep getting beat up. The way you jump on it. All right. <laughs> yeah, I got my whole body into it. Well, Ultraman was down bad on that one. All right. Use the glutes. <laughs> so I'm going to jump on you one day. What the fuck? 12,003. So he getting open this from the future now. All right. I was like, yo, Gabba Gabba. It do. Ultra Junior. Right. <laughs> he comes with his own Happy Meals. Right. Does he also come with action diapers? Or is that sold separately? Look at me. I'm so cute. I have a big head. Right? He even did the cute pose. Mm. This is all you need. I don't need to fight monsters. Very much kawaii. I don't even pay my own giant bills. They got a black Pinocchio back there. Wow. Beating the air up with oh, a mallet. Wow. What the hell? Get it, black Pinocchio. Puppet mine. I'm gonna be just like Dad. Right. And Uncle Julius. Notice me, hey, senpai. Dad, it's me. Right. Your son. Mom said you didn't pay child support. 
the hell is this? It's like the crackhead armor right there. I know. It's like an old flashback or something. That does, does like a cool costume you can give a kid, though. Mm -hmm. And they can run around in until they pass out from the heat. Hit. Right. Look at the monsters laughing at this dude. Right. Yeah, I, I can feel it, man. You know, you gotta okay. have dreams and ambitions. Orb, the origin saga. Mm -hmm. Boy, right. you know they hit you with them sixty frames. It's going down. Beautiful color. All right. Fruity, delicious. Mm -hmm. They trying to hurry up and get their opening over with. Mm. <laughs> you idiots can't see me from up here. Right. Okay, a little T-Pain on there. Okay, all their forms match their color motifs. You know, uniforms. You saw how he had to wait. He had to hold his like, hurry up, man. Yeah. Okay, another origin story. Ultraman the biopic. So it was like early 2000s or no, like mid 2000s. Right? There you go. You gotta catch up with this form. That was a little sexy right there. <laughs> I see he's kind of like the Joker of this series. Like he's evil, but he likes to joke around or something. Damn. Ultra Galaxy Fight New Generation Heroes. Oh wow, that shit looked dramatic. Ah damn. I have to shoot the letters out. Okay, this gotta be an anniversary special or like something. Ego up in the house. Victory. You notice that a lot. They always gotta have B's for victory and X's and stuff. That's cool, Sore. Are they fighting each other? Oh my god. It's like they don't waste no time with that. This looks really good. Yeah. It's like who can whoop whose ass when it comes to an Ultraman battle? And who's gonna be the annoying chick? There you go. Beat up the monsters, man. The monsters been laughing at y'all. Maybe they decided that they would get it together and fight them. Yeah, and that's usually what I hear. That's what it's like with like stuff like Tokusatsu, Super Sentai. Like even though the teams are good, they be conflicting on who's the good one when they meet up with each other, mm -hmm. and they end up fighting before becoming bros. Ooh. Costume designs came a long way, boy. Get us some Ultraman costumes. For real, man. Super Sentai, y'all need to step y'all game up. Especially Kamen Rider, because Ultraman, they killing y'all. I'm sorry. These suits are fresh. The absolute conspiracy. Yeah, these are definitely like crossover specials. I wonder if there's like a continuity, though. They're like, do they acknowledge the stuff that happened in the past? And they'll be like, man, I gotta fight you again. Okay. Got more of them in there. Oh. Mom and dad said make just make them proud. <laughs> I 
old school, so you gonna get in the mix. Right. I don't give a damn if y'all got leather on y'all suits or not. Beat y'all ass spandex. Ooh, rip <laughs> off the cake. Rip it off, baby. It's time to throw beams and elbows. The backgrounds look a lot cooler. So it's, like, it's like you it's a CGI, but the compositing is done well. I <laughs> you saw he was hitting that thing right. on the head. <laughs> Just out of the cabinet. Right. Test that last zero strike right, cake you want to. Ugh, old girl, like she was trying to hold something in over there. Yo, I'm trying to give it to you. It's gonna give it to you. <laughs> For real. Uh, now or never. I thought that was like now on Blu ray or something. I'm loving these. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they look really good. The Destined Crossroad. So they got Bone Thugs and Harmony up in here. That would be hilarious. <laughs> I'm gonna kick everybody. I'm gonna kick everybody's ass. I do too. I believe myself. <laughs> Why are those two cross-eyed? I'm trying to figure it out. Oh no! Ah, get over here, and you. Oh, they got a little junior in the mix too. They don't like both of me. They do. What is up with the cross-eyed Ultraman? Can somebody explain <laughs> that in the comment section? I don't even know. I don't even think I want to know. Yeah, you're right. Maybe we'll just figure out on our own while they're cross-eyed. I'm going to fist everybody. Hadouken. They always do that pose, y'all, when they jumping out of an explosion. Never lose my way, baby. Never. Oh, she ugly. Yeah, we got a legacy, man. Say that to us. Oh, I can't do it Got my man uh, Vante up on the production. Got Mr. Dalvin or somebody. He's like, boy! <laughs> well, that monster's blasting. Yeah, I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of using these T-Rex arms. I'm shooting everybody. Right. <laughs> so you guys get to do all the flips and dips. And you get to look cool, too. <laughs> yeah. So he be doing shit for no reason sometimes. He being extra. I mean, this is how you gotta be when your name is Ultraman. You gotta be Ultra. Uh, he, and probably, extra. he probably got a cousin named Extra Man that just be doing shit for no reason. Extra Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he let y'all finish out. Did it? Did it? Did it? to break it down mm -hmm. on us. It sounds like he said too many multiple, multicultural. Why is that sound like me say, you better move your feet? <laughs> he probably did. <laughs> Celestial Arrow. I really do want to know why some Ultraman have pupils and other ones don't. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's always it. nice to mix. it's nice to be reminded on past mistakes you know to show how far they've come oh. I like when they always land like that I'm gonna have to catch up on the scoreboard with you with it with the yawning you know, that's always something I do. Yeah. Oh, I that nigga like look clean. You like who? Fruit. Wow. Fly Ultraman. Fly. Ultra King over here. 
Rising high, Ultraman, Red Sudden. Red Sukayo? It's like my stomach want to sing along. It's growling its ass off. That's what that was. Yep, you heard that? <laughs> I didn't know what that was. It's like watching these walking fruit roll ups got me over here hungry. <laughs> That's the one you talking about that we have the cross eyes. Yeah. <laughs> what do you, how do you know those are pupils though? What else are they? I don't know. It might just be like a, a pattern, design pattern or something. Rising high. Okay, beautiful Joe. It. <laughs> no. Are you like the non-athletic member on the team? Ultra fight. Yeah, yeah. It's a lot of ultra man. Ultra steel. It's like oh, uh, fucking um, all might better appear up in one of these. Put some plus ultra on that thing. Oh. I'm telling some music I've heard on the game a long time ago. They do. Boy, if I was like a super young kid, I would have ate this shit all the way up. I would have also ate it up now because I'm hungry. That way you forget to order your food at the drop through. Yeah. about to sacrifice herself in the name of love. Ah! That sounds like some uh, a douchebag would do. Just come in the booth and just ah. And then it actually ends up kind of good. Right. I'm like, no, this sounds what, dope right here, y'all. Fight? He is. He is fighting his life. They trying to steal his school lunch, so he has to. Right. Not today. Yeah. The one on the far left, like a Power Ranger. Ultra fly. Ultra fly. Kick it. Yeah. Like, sweep it. Spin it. Poke it. Chop it. Oh, yeah. What they are doing the most. They are. It, it takes a lot of dedication and memory to do all those things. He on that Yeezy collection with his outfit shit. Take a weaving. <laughs> shit, that's what you say when you go to the weave store? I don't go to the weave store. Take a weaving. You got the Ken Shiro cowl on. You know, for the suplex on? I feel sorry for the cameraman. He's getting his ass whooped. Right? <laughs> they kicking him and everything. About to uh, ultra beat your ass. Right? Zoom in if you want to. Hey, we got enough time to make sure he's out the way. Let's go kick more cameraman's asses. Final Wars, you know, down well, that, that ain't the final one. Well, they came out with this one. They did. This singer probably been waiting to sing since 1978. So he had to come out swinging. have landed. Okay. See? Oh, uh-oh! 
Oh, they look cool. They all look cool. For real. But the Ultraman is that they ain't because the villain's looking cool. Shit, how you know that was a villain? Oh, are well, you right? Maybe they look cool. The other people look cool, whoever they are, villains or not. Yeah, he is villains, I guess. The way they came in looking all sinister. They putting suplexes on people now, though. And my man Batter is still low on this thing. <laughs> the ultimate pimp slap. The final, final wars, wars, baby. The final wars. Not <laughs> first, the final. Yeah, ultra brave. I seen him a lot, man. He's been featured in a lot of these openings. Who's that Giga again? Yeah, you look good at night, man. Go ahead and flex. You like a walking energy drink. Blueberry. There's just something about blue that I like on the character too. It just looks cooler for some reason. Like just the blue. It's like the red looks a little dusty at times. I like a good mix of both, like that last thing we just saw. Yeah. Like if it's just red and silver, I guess that looks alright too, but that blue really hit though. That nigga he looked look, he looked the tightest. Yeah. <laughs> See, you abusing these things. I be really want to know what escalated to get to this point. Right? I mean, with them things be abusing them too. It's like they just be fighting amongst each other. And here's old Ultraman. Ooh. It's like the person who tries to break up the fight by starting the fight. Right. They're like a good thumbnail right there. Sparkling water future to the galaxy of dreams. New Ultraman. Can't doing the twist around again. He is. See, he attacks. He, he, he don't care who you fight. I'm attacking anything that's that's walking. Mm -hmm. Whether it be me, my, my comrade, right, a Godzilla monster, the run up can, and get done up. The hell was that he had in his hand? Ooh, there you go. <laughs> I can't even get over the, the ass now that you've been pointing them out. The ones with the cross eyes? Yeah, just the pupils in general, because I think the pupils just look out of place. It looks weird. Uh oh, who is that? The lava oh, monster? Right, Lord Zed. The right? Mm. That rock we kick on him. Right. <laughs> they have to show out to even this. Right. They gonna double team on Mr. Krabs. Yeah. Ultraman red suiting, so they just basically retreading old territory. So I keep seeing Ginga, or whatever his name is. It's been a long time, bro. Been doing this shit for a while now. You had to summon the uh, the logo, right? <laughs> Power oh, staff, he is. See, it's like they be using their little acrobatic and athleticism to their advantage. Oh, we got a whip. Was that a tentacle? It looked like it. Man, these poor monsters. I feel so bad for the them. The monster tentacle often is using it as his personal whip. Right, we got to deal with these niggas that have obviously taken five-hour energy shots. 
and just want to fight stuff. No! Damn. They jumped there, monster. <laughs> Like you more for the monster than you are for Ultraman. I, said, I just want to know the whole story, man. How did these things happen before y'all to jump these monsters like this? Song of Ultraman Victory. Mm. And they got a dragon flute. Right, like he's playing an instrument? <laughs> That nigga came in, man. Oh, they're going to kick some ass? Yeah. I like the pictures getting clearer now. It kind of did. He started off all pixelated and stuff. But as soon as the dude clears his throat, it gets better. Come on, uh. Drill Oman? Chelsea Tomato. Y'all. Oh I don't God. know which one of y'all is evil which one of y'all This shit is good. unfair. All they needed is a one, uh, one inch punch on his head. This shit is unfair, bro. That nigga skating on something. A trickster from Devil May Cry. Okay, Crystal Light. Mm -hmm. They should have put me on a track. They should, because you over here giving it everything. Like, you auditioning. Mm-hmm. Ultra Man X. What the hell happened, y'all? Okay, it, it took y'all frame rate to catch up with the logo. Squeeze those glutes. See, when the monster even try to do something frail, like flexible, like a kick, leg just gets grabbed and blocked. This <laughs> head is so little. And so he got all the accessories I see. He's like, you already got armor, but let's just add more armor to this dude and make him unstoppable. Give him a nice sword. He's like, I got blue lips Boy, in this mode. Over there double team on that they they was. Was triple or quadruple team on him. I wouldn't be surprised if like Gen Tama has a parody episode where they show how much of a bully Ultraman can be. All right. In. So is this is like a, a ongoing series. Well, I did say you're in 2016. I don't know if these openings or endings or what. They definitely look like uh, openings. Now, that nigga suit looked dope. It did. That was Rainbow Sun. Yeah. Monsters like they get more sinister looking now. But they like they'll still get their slap. Right. <laughs> so his sole purpose is to fight these types of monsters. Like I guess. Oh, shit, they got Royal Rumble matches? Everybody <laughs> fighting. All right. First one who gets thrown into a building loses. Bruh. Mm. 
Mm. It's like, how much more of an advantage do you need, bro? You you got the weapons that you're using and shit. I mean, you never can have too many weapons. I, I mean, you know, I, I just see I see everything different now, man. Like, after watching fucking Kamen Rider and seeing how monsters get mistreated, I don't know what to think. It's like, Ultraman got everything under the kitchen sink when it comes to, like, moves, weapons. Other members that'll just slide on your ass at the drop of a hat. It's like, come on now. I see it in your eyes. That kind of yeah. reminds me of the Berserk armor from Berserk. Mm -hmm. Like, the only ones that can really just get with them niggas is like. People that look like them but are, are evil. Yeah. Oh, he had the leg up. He did. Trying to show off the articulation that he has in that suit. Okay. That nigga over there looking mm. like an uh, Optimus um, crime. Hell. It's like he gonna violate somebody's suit. Well, they just flying. My boy over there got his arms folded up right. like Vegeta. There can only be one Ultraman number one. They playing that guitar. The Chronicle of Ultra. You know, we're in the background. Oh. Now, this man been walking on the moon for the past seven openings. And I think this is the same opening. It's the same it show, too, same. I see. I mean, it looks the same. They just trying to showcase how this opening goes good with anything, any song. You know what I'm saying? They're going to put Brownstone. They're going to play that with it next. If you love me, show it. Nah, they gonna put Grapevine on there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> For real. They need an Ultraman to fill them up. Okay, hopefully this is the last time. Hopefully. I it's badass, but damn. It's almost like they just took pride in that opening. Mm -hmm. and I was like, they just put different songs in it. We ain't getting canceled anytime soon, so right. the hell with it. And they got the leather jacket on. Yeah. The Chronicle. Thank you. Now, if the monsters had any sense, they would expose the zipper in the back of the Ultraman's costume. Right. So that'll be funny. You get caught lacking and he ain't got no drawers on underneath that suit. That'll be funny. That'll be everybody can see that shit. All the people from underneath could probably see something else. Mm -hmm. It's like, how can something so giant still have something such strippy? No. <laughs> Don't say it. Rainbow dash his ass there. He is Yeah, that's a cool looking monster. Okay. Oh, they was gonna punch each other. No, they just swinging their air. They, they like they just swinging their fists in the air from frustration or something. Ooh, got that hat tilted to the All side. Right, rock climbing Johnny. Hope the youth. That don't even sound right. Hope the youth. You hope the youth don't grow up to be stupid idiots and stink up society. Coming up. Do it. Punch the air.
Well, you're the only losers up in this movie theater. <laughs> That's kind of cool how they did that. Yeah. It's like they're watching a movie that only they want to see. And everybody else decided not to come in there. Well, it looked like he was just praising the Lord. He was. Nah, y'all doing too much now. You know, we're not already allowed you to bring your own food up in here. But they cleaned it up. No. <laughs> he blasted that one dude just now. Oh, wow. They blasted him again. Oh, ain't gonna be none of that. See, it's all funny games. So you fight an enemy that's now, all armored. Oh, that dude look tight. They kill the monsters in the park. And broad daylight. Mm, they didn't turn the movie off. They got pulled out. It wasn't making that many box office ticket sales. <gasps> this movie's a flop. Greed. Oh, zero indeed. Okay. Geed. Geed. See, that's why you gotta read. You gotta geed it. You gotta geed. I will do that later. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Why not? No. Mm -hmm. This sounds like some 2004 soft rock. Oh, yeah. Yes. I'll be there. My hair is messed up. <laughs> <laughs> so I put on this helmet. Oh, I like how you did that, man. I'm about to shoot his ass up. Oh, I can't see what's going on. Yeah, this is pretty pixelated. You have any reason to be in this hallway? You have a hall pass, sir. I will say that it seems like all the new creative suits have kind of like slowed down. Because we're seeing the reoccurring. I mean, these, yeah. We're seeing these suits over and over and over. Even if it's a new name of a show. Maybe this is a different kind of suit. Yeah. That was a guess I'm new. It's not a goddamn fighting game intro. This sound like it should be at the beach. Mmm. Say at the beach. Mm -hmm. I'm not having his nose. Yeah. Come on, bro. You gonna lose to a girl? I mean, hey, you be that way sometimes. I guess his bones are just as fragile as hers. Gotta stretch that shit. <laughs> ah, right? <laughs> Squat with that shit. All I want is to protect you. Mm -hmm. All I want to do. Right. They got slash over there slashing it. <laughs> they look weird. They do. All that build up for that reveal. <laughs> That's a duet. Now these other characters look even cooler. We've seen them before. Yeah. Especially that monster right mm -hmm. there. Looks like a crossover. One. 
I do wonder what these are, like if these are shows or movies or what. Yeah. Because we've seen all these characters before. We have. I see why it's it's compilated the way it is now. La 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 Whoa 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 <laughs> that was just watching the TV Right that big one looks cute and ugly at the same time 1969 we taking it back again Taking it all the way back to the 69s Oh no Oh my god Duh. Maybe that's the one that they're supposed to be referencing with the cross eyes. Maybe. Play this in a club, y'all. Tell the DJ turn this shit up. No black folks are still getting down to it. Oh, I don't know if I'd be getting down to it. I'm sure you would, though. I would. Go ahead, show us your best moves. I can't do all that in the chair. <laughs> I'll tear up this place trying to dance to this. Oh, it went off. Damn. What was that? Hanuman versus Seven Ultraman? Why is it in Indonesian or... Thai or whatever. I have no idea what language that is. I don't need it. It doesn't look like Japanese. Yeah. Wait a minute. They done did something with that. Shit made me want to put on my white do rag. (laughs) Play it. Spit it, bro. They didn't even have to turn this on. Boy, what they done did? Yeah, Yeah, like y'all done got the person that sang Jinder Mahal songs. I was gonna fall asleep. This done woke me up right here. It did. Well, got you back crunk again, at least for the next 30 seconds. At least. Before you doze off again. Right? Ah, ah, ah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to come off offensive, but that just sounded so funny. Boy. And he is just continuing to go for it. This is my new jam right here. I'm about to say, my love for you. Oh. What language is this? I don't know. I need this on my Spotify right it here. Looks, I don't know if it's Thai or what. It's just. <laughs> the Six Ultra Brothers versus the Monster Army. I don't think nothing's going to beat that. Okay. Yeah, okay, so this is more of like an ultra get together or something from the 70s. Uh oh! That's probably what that, that one right there came from that previous one we just watched, probably. He is losing <laughs> it. He is so crunk right now. Get those niggas! What's with the sound, y'all? Alright, now. Right? It's like, what are we supposed to do? They're just flipping and dipping. <laughs> I like how self aware this shit is. It's like, we're here, okay. Yeah, hey, whooping my asses. <laughs> oh no! Oh shit, that's the chemical plants. Yeah, y'all still wanna flip. <laughs> I 
Y'all are literally destroying the city that you're trying to protect. They don't care nothing about that. They just we're gonna show these monsters. He was uh, crawling away in defeat. <laughs> Let him go. Please. Oh god. Damn. Beat in the ass. Beat in the ass. They are beating this man with a sword. Stop resisting. Get sliced in half. I don't think I like this one. <laughs> Oh wow, really? Bitch! No. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> this is the worst one, I'm sorry. This is hilarious. Wow. Come on, you can't run no faster than that. Alright, why don't you look back? You and the baby done just fell down. What kind of ending is that to an opening? It's like these idiots. Meanwhile, while they're fighting these monsters and acting stupid with their flips, you got an innocent family about to be murdered. Magnation. Uh, get off of me, nigga. I ain't no strong monster. Right now, a ultra pizza would be nice. With some glow in the dark pepperoni. I don't think you want that. Yeah, I might get like some kind of stomach cancer or something. Let it shine. Let it shine. For real. Yeah, I'm right. I'm gone, y'all. Mm. <laughs> oh, I can cook me some um, chitlins. Kids cha cha. I'm already not going to like that. Ultraman kids. Boys, that say Proverbs. Why did you say I'm going to like one girl? Yeah, I was like, girl, you better give it a chance. You might rock out to this. Oh, baby. It is. It's cute. He is. This looks cuter than the live action one we saw. Right. I'll shoot. There goes my friend. Ultra Susie. How you doing, girl? La la la. They like the plants on house. It do. Ultra Boy and Ultra Susie walking to school. <laughs> Blueberry Billy. I like how the monsters are a part of the school right. too. It's like, yeah, we're enemies now, but the we grew up together. And the little monsters. Ultra babies, we obliterate things for you. When your head looks kind of Asking mama for thirty million light years. I don't think mama got that. Right. I hit that Megan to that. Let's go. Oh, Ultra boy, Ultra Susie. Ultra babies, we're still going through. Give me an Ultra boy plush. <laughs> so cute. I do. <laughs> Aww. That poor little baby bird. Right. That's why your ass just got knocked out. You a terrible blocker. It's like the muscles look cuter than the Ultra babies. Mm, I don't know about that. Oh, what's up, him? Put some ultra booty grease into it. That thing got lips bigger than mine. Really, nigga? Why don't y'all even let his ass tug a war with y'all? Skip it on stars. Uh, yeah. 
you can free. Oh, wow. They just going to ultra baby everything, huh? He don't look like the other ultra baby. He don't. They kind of do, but... Oh, it's a dad. That's why. Mm. Okay, yeah, he got bills to pay. No wonder. He's like, y'all to see how far he's grown up now. Probably the same kid we was watching. Right. Man, where I leave my wallet at? I'm gonna change it. Wow. <laughs> now they're homeless. Damn. That is so messed up. Uh oh. An uh, ultra prostitute. <laughs> there go another one. What is going on in this? I don't even know. Why y'all trying to make fun of the fact that y'all have power and we don't? What is that gonna do, Ultra Man? Oh wow. They over here having sex and shit and burning the whole city down. It'd be like that sometimes, man. Ultra Man Super Fighter Legend. Oh. Yeah, we're in animated territory from here on out, probably. Play it. I want to be the very best. Say it. That no one ever was. To beat them is my real test. And Ultra Beam is the cause. I don't have anything else to say. Smith. I was running out of things to replace with Ultra. You get impaled by a ship. We got the Sailor Witch. Yeah. It's funny, it's like most of those Sailor we saw in the past were animated, but they still felt live action. Mm -hmm. But this feels animated, even though it's in the same format. Mm -hmm. I guess because of the proportions. Mm -hmm. Ah! Flex on him. Flex on him. Mr. Crab. And the sinister Dr. Claw XX. I'll get you, Ultraman. Next time, nigga. Okay, Ultraman Mini. <laughs> the hell? Don't you just hate when a whale lands on top right. of you? Right. That's murder, sir. Luckily, he has his Ultra Baby suit on. Kick it. Patch a star over there. <laughs> Play it. I feel like I'm watching Little Big Planet. This is like a fever dream. I don't know what this is. Yeah. Gumby? Alright, y'all. Well, I should have missed the part. I should have been dozing off on him. Alright. Like somebody ultra beat me upside the head. Mm -hmm. Put me out of my misery. Oh my god. We gonna keep going till you get tired. And they just showed the scene already. <laughs> Make it stop. Ultraman oh. Netflix. So this is the only one I'm familiar with. Okay, yeah, the one. Yeah, definitely. Did we even listen to the opening? No, we didn't. Because you love to skip the opening. Of course, I always skip them. Ooh, that, that transformation is clean. Yeah, I remember his dad was an Ultraman or something. Yeah, it was
Ooh. Slash to everything. So they got about 20 Ultramans on this version. We might have to go back and watch it. We might have to, because I know they had a sequel or a second season. It actually wasn't even bad when we watched it. I just it wasn't. Know. It just we just had other it stuff. It wasn't the right to, time. Yeah. Well, you know, apartment one watched this. Yep. Yeah. So it's been two years. Been three years. Oh, three years. Yeah. I'm going on four now. Hey, mm -hmm. she was squatted up. That was jamming right there. That was. Do your thing, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, season two, see 2022. Got the X Men DNA. Whoa, whoa, it's all right. Bounce. This nigga gonna run out of oxygen trying to do shit like this. Ooh, they got Johnny Storm up in there too. Yeah. I'm feeling this. Disobey it, dude. Hey, like the special effects got better in this one. Mm -hmm. Robot hooker maids. Right. I see his dad got involved. <laughs> but they have a whole yeah. family together. For real. Damn cookout. Well, they keep going back and forth, Lord. They do English dub. We don't, we don't want to hear that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see what kind of lame lyrics y'all going to come with Ultraman dub. Sounds like the same thing. <laughs> no. This ain't got a piece of soul in it. It don't. I ain't put no butter or seasoning on y'all grits. Let's y'all record this shit on. A potato. Real. No. Yeah, yeah, I hear with that shit. Ultraman Two: The fu Further Adventures of What? Oh wow! What well, hurt my neck? <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear about you having a headache. That's later. exactly what they're gonna be hearing too. This jamming though. It's like Michael Jackson, you know, that's that type 70s Michael music. Jackson. Medicine is too funky to be an ultra man. <laughs> Ooh, we didn't put the Jackson 5 on here. Get your groove on, y'all. What happened when you can't show us your best dance moves? You're gonna try to play some. I mean, that's not me. That's my body reacting to the music. Mm. Man, you yeah, ain't had that right to be funky and groovy like that. 
That was too groovy. My goodness. Ultra 7. He was dub. Oh, shit. Here we go again. No. This is where I'll probably go take me a bathroom break. No. <laughs> oh, that's bathroom break worthy. I just know the English dub is going to suck. I just know. Ultra 7. The way they say seven probably ain't even gonna sound right. <laughs> Are you really gonna go take a bathroom break for this? Lord. <laughs> it's not that bad. Yeah. 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 You've been enlisted into a top secret agency called. It wasn't that bad. I think. I yeah. think this is better than all trauma. Right. Yeah, you know, Fox Box, you know, four kids, they did that thing on this. Mm -hmm. Ultraman! Boy! That's what they should call it. They should call it the Boy Beans. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right, he did that. That's pretty good. <laughs> Ultraman! The Destined Crossroad. Is this English dub too? Yeah. I was supposed to Japanese person saying it. I guess so. Okay, this actually sounds pretty good. Yeah. I don't know why. It, this is where I would rather watch it if a Japanese person sings it in English mm -hmm. because they still know how to make it sound similar to the Japanese counterpart to that native I don't know why that shit is so funny motherfucker take it take it take it take it want a lot of nipples too as a matter of fact mm. I'll never lose my way never okay. I ain't never finna get lost Space Warriors 2000 1985. God damn, boy, y'all really old. This look older than the 60 versions that we was watching. Do. You're, You're a monkey, a monkey wrench. wrench. So this is just the opening titles. Right. I bet that's what some of these were. I know it said what some of them were. I didn't just get a chance to read them before mm -hmm. it started. I feel like I'm watching Jackson's Family American Dream. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mothra. Oh, Mothra was up in this? Mm -mm. Okay. Hanuman Godzelda. Godzelda. Wow. And live in person, Chris Rock. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Keep my wife's name out of your fucking mouth. 
the little old toy maker. Definitely stunt man whose names we could not read. Right. <laughs> Bruh. Okay, so the, uh, somebody had to translate this. <laughs> like somebody bumped into the speaker. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, sorry, man. Accidental. Oriental. <laughs> yeah, just so we need a sign to distort things even more. Return of the Oh, children. shoot. The Masuzu children, of course. Return of the man. We've seen this. It's probably going to be an English version. No, I said the Masuzu Chin, of course. Oh. This might be different. Yeah, hey, showing those ships again. Yeah. Would you like my saying to you like this? Yes, please do it. Yeah. That was lovely. I'll take more of that later on. Okay. <laughs> Suck it. Honey nights. Yeah, you see the Mazumi kids back up in this shit, man. I just took it back to the start on this again. Yeah, I'm seeing the sploos come back. I swear we've seen this already. I'm, I'm just trying to watch everything. Maybe it's like added effects or something. This time in color. Or more color. Quake it, bake it, move it, shake it, roll it around. Tell them what to do, children. Earth it, bake it, move it, quake it, roll it around. Tell them what to do. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Shake your booty, shake your booty. Yeah. Children's chorus. Well, y'all had to just drive a knife up in our ass before we end off this thing. Well, I'm gonna have to double check to see if this is really. If it's the same exact thing, you might as well edit this out. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The frame rate got lower. We've seen this one like twice already. Yeah, this thing already had like three different versions. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, this city always comes to mind. Give me a congratulations. Whew, but guys, that was all of the openings. Every Ultra Man opening, 1966 through 2022. It's like we went back to 1966 to 2022 by three times over. You know, which I guess that's the Ultra way we of kept doing going things. Back and forth. Back, back and forth. And forth. Right. That's what we was doing. I don't love ghosts. No. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, but I will say that it seems like even though you know, I think that hour and 30 minute mark start to kick in, like when we got to that Boy, point. Boy, no, it was the hour mark. When that hour mark kicked in, I don't know what I don't know if y'all seen me dozing off. Okay, yeah. it was not even because I was not interested, but it's just not uh, anyway, so I was like, Lord, stay awake, stay awake. Stay yeah, awake. man. And but then, wait, when that got down, I don't know if it was Indonesian, Vietnamese, Indian. I don't know what that was. But when that came on, I was like, what? I what know. Like, the funkier they got, the more I got into them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, because I think it kind of reached that. We, we kind of reached that point to where we were like, okay, this is all they have to offer in terms of designs. Because we're starting to see reoccurring designs just appear over and over. Especially during, like, the more crossover specials if i can call them that like i'm not sure if those are like series specials where it's like an all-star cast of characters from the previous seasons whatever they may be it's like the flair and the wow factor did kind of like dip a little bit in terms of like what new designs are they going to bring to the table and stuff you know because we've seen all they have i'm seeing now that they got they do actually have movies like ultraman rb I guess red and blue, the crystal bond. So, uh, yeah, man. But um, overall, I had a good time with these. I did. I have to say I had a good time. I have to give these an S. Yeah, I'm giving them an S as well, you know, because I was dreading doing these guys. I was dreading doing these more than him and anybody else I know. So, yeah, um, you know, long story short, you know, I kept insisting that we get this knocked out of the way. But stuff kept coming up, you know. She had then the one day I was ready to do it, he was sick. So yeah. I had to get my tonsils taken out. I'm still getting over my sickness. Yeah, as you can tell, he still sounds stuffy. I'm but still nasally, so bear with us, you know. But I don't think I had that many sniffle whipples during this reaction itself. Yeah, uh, I think I had to make a note of my favorite ones. Uh, yeah. So we got the 2014 and the 2015. This is in order. Mm -hmm. So whatever, however it went, because it kept going back. But it was yeah. the 2014 and the 2015 one. I was jamming out to that. It was live action. Then it was a 1983 movie that I liked. Mm -hmm. Then I liked, I don't know, again, like I said, I don't know if it was Vietnamese, what, uh, yeah, Indonesian. That. I don't know what they had going on, <laughs> but that was jamming. Where it, it had the planet and the, the you know, solar system and all that. Yeah. And then at 2019 and 2022, uh, Netflix, mm -hmm. those was great. Yeah, and then man. that that whatever that 1984 groovy one was, boy, that boy, was it right there. For real, I'm like, gonna break my neck on that. Don't one. blame it on the sunshine, right? Uh, don't blame it on the ultra beams. Blame anyway, it on the ass. Yeah, people. these were mostly pretty good. I'm, I'm glad we finally got this over with. I hope y'all enjoy yourselves. I hope y'all do too, man. Y'all better turn up and show out on this one because because if if you don't, we're gonna beat y'all up. You know the rendering times are gonna be insane for my rig, and it's probably gonna be going up to ninety degrees because I haven't been updating everything on my computer. Yeah, but nonetheless, though, I appreciate everything Ultraman stands for, and I I love it. You know, I, I think I might check out. We gonna have to go back and look at Netflix series. You know, we, do you, would you like to react to that one? We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, some it's a lot to get in front of this light and stuff, but yeah, it's no wonder that this thing has continued to withstand the test of time. Giants are cool, but when you add like giant superheroes, that's even cooler, you know. Which is why the Kyodai uh, genre continues to excel to greater heights, even though it's already taller than a motherfucker. So um, yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, uh, let us know what you think about those. If we had any questions, I always forget what we say because we always say random stuff. Hopefully, you guys don't take offense to it, especially the diehards of this, even though um, if you did, cry more. But try not to take offense to it. Live a little. 
enjoy the randomness that we say even if it's cringe even if it's not necessarily accurate to what's going on on the screen it's like of course this is called we ain't seen it reactions we ain't seen it so we just yeah. add in whatever silly stuff we want to say or whatever because we really don't know yeah but if there's a dedicated community the ultra man whether it be like online threads such as reddit or facebook pages or any kind of social media of that format by all being shared with your respective communities we love getting you guys feedback on this stuff and you know just sharing our you know reactions with you all and yeah but this is your boy rbg aka the random black gamer my lovely wife johnny lee on the ones and twos we ain't seen the reactions we'll catch you guys next time on our openings reaction that's not over two hours long because that's it this is the last one this is the final curtain call this is it peace